Well, we have not one, but two incredible survival stories this morning. First, the brother and sister back on land after making a 14-hour swim to shore. They were in open water when their fishing boat sank off St. Lucia, and the two are now talking about the vacation that nearly killed them and how they helped each other stay alive. ABC's Rob Nelson is here with more. Really a vacation that turned into a nightmare. Incredible survival story, though, here, guys. Good morning, everybody. It's a survival story, though, also being called a miracle. These American siblings battling huge waves and fearing sharks for more than half a day and somehow living to tell the story. Siblings Dan and Kate Susky took what they thought was a vacation to paradise in St. Lucia. But as they embarked on a fishing trip, the Caribbean vacation turned into a terrifying ordeal for the two. No, it was intense. It was a long, long day, long 20 odd hours. The siblings were out eight miles off the coast when the fishing boat they chartered started to fill with water, which put the two in the water as they watched the boat capsize. I think it was completely surreal, you know, watching the boat stern down, just go subsurface and seeing it underwater was, it was surreal. Along with the Suskies, the boat's captain and first mate were sent swimming as well, but quickly lost sight of them as the swell separated them. We could see land off in the distance um, and started swimming that direction and then uh, it would disappear intermittently as we swam, but um, we felt the wind behind us and tried to use that as a gauge for direction. The two siblings, now separated from the captain and first mate, would begin a grueling 14-hour swim to shore, battling hypothermia. You can see here some of the scarring left behind from the salt water and life jacket. We were very lucky. We found a very small sliver of beach, and we were able to uh, get to safety that way. The pair spent the night eating bananas and mangoes before spotting a farmer the following day. We didn't really know what to say. It must have been so strange for him to see us. Amazing story. Now, the brother and sister were treated for dehydration and some other minor injuries. They are reportedly flying to Miami today to reunite with their father. Meanwhile, the captain and first mate, they were also rescued by a private boat after spending 23 hours in the water themselves. It's still unclear exactly what caused that boat to sink, guys. But amazing they were able to stay focused and get back to shore amazing. 14 hours. Amazing that all four survived. Exactly. All right, Rob, thank you. Sure.